in just a few short weeks, the kids will be out of school for the winter <laughs> break and ready for a fun family getaway. From, really fun. From safaris <laughs> to ski slopes to saunas. There's, There's something for everyone, there isn't is, there? There, is. there really is. So pack your bags because here with some great deals is Orbits.com's senior editor, Janine Tornatore. We love her. I love, 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 love the specs. Thank Very you. good. Yeah. You're smart. Yeah. So I'm going for it. Yeah. <laughs> All right, Sedona, Arizona is a spot you like. It is. It's just 90 minutes outside of Phoenix. Uh -huh. uh, there's so much to do here for the family, and I think that these desert destinations get overlooked for warm weather escapes. They actually have this really cool uh, safari Animal experience yeah. called, called Out of Africa. It covers 104 <laughs> acres. It's a great place to take the kids. Um, and in addition to that, Sedona has over 200 miles of trails for mountain biking, hiking, Jeep tours. Kids so want much to be going active, on. Don't they? The hotel <laughs> I love here is the Hilton Sedona Resort and Spa mm -hmm. from $159 a night on Orbitz in February. It has something for every. An 18 hole championship golf course, three pools, including Ooh, a kids' that's pool, pretty. and kids of course, love that. a great spa. Yeah. So all another, around a great property. Another great spot for kids is the Atlantis in the Bahamas. Yes. And I was just at the, in the Bahamas at that hotel. It's beautiful. The Bahamas is one of the great values in the Caribbean. And of course, Atlantis is kind of the spotlight yeah. of Nassau. Although there are other cool things going on. There's the Pirates of Nassau Interactive Museum in downtown Nassau, and some fun things like that to do with the kids. Uh -huh. But in Atlantis, um, they're right here for February. You can get a hotel room room in their coral towers from $306 a night. And I know that sounds like a splurge. However, there's a really cool promotion going on where you get $100 resort credit per room per stay. You can use that on literally anything there. And you have to also remember that they have this Aqua Adventure water park that I'm sure you've maybe yeah. been to, 26 acres. And that is it's included in your stay. Yeah. People that aren't staying there pay upwards of $100 a day for a pass to the go place, there. By yeah. the way, it's so kid friendly. It I is. Mean, and then if, you're, if you want to go like you did, you go to the Cove, right? right. Oh, it and it's yeah. more for grown ups. Right. There's yeah. something for everyone there as well. Okay. okay, there's a place in Colorado. What is it called? Crested Butte. Crested Butte. I'm glad <laughs> I've been to Crested Butte. It's fun. Uh -huh. it, it, it's, it's great. It's, it's, it's wild, of, wild west town. Okay. It is. It's in the Gunnison National Forest. They actually have one of the largest national historic districts in Colorado. So the downtown is just amazing. And so is the mountain. And it's cool because it has. it's one of the largest resorts on the continent with just one base area. So mm -hmm. as a parent, if your kids are old enough to ski on their own, you can kind of let them go because everybody funnels back down to that to one base place. area. Mm -hmm. And it's really family friendly. They have a lot of, um, they have an adventure park with tubing, ice skating, a climbing wall, a zip line. The property I like here is the Lodge at Mountaineer Square from $146 a night in wow. February. It's a member of the Preferred Hotel Group. It's an all-suites property, so it's really great for families. Okay, uh, Park City, Utah is another, is another yeah, great spot. a lot of people know love Park it City. So pretty, it's kind yeah. of one of those quintessential ski towns. It's great. There's actually three ski resorts here that have great ski schools and ski family skiing areas. But what's unique about Park City is that you have access to the Utah Utah Olympic Park, which was home to the 2002 oh, yeah. Winter Olympics, and it's now a training center. But there's some cool experiences. You can bob, take bobsled rides down an Olympic track. Oh I'm pretty God. sure you have someone in there with you, I but it does so. go pretty fast. And you can take a chairlift ride to the top of the, to the top of the highest altitude ski jump. And you get to take a chairlift back down, cool. don't worry. Yeah, you don't have to jump. <laughs> yeah. But the property here is the Sundial Lodge at the okay. Canyons Resort from $199 a night. It's right at the gondola, everything you're looking for in the Good. All right, thanks, Janine. Coming up tomorrow, one